Okay, so I'm going to go ahead and do another chapter review of your first year in network marketing by Mark and Renee Yarnell. Uh, this is chapter four, and it's called um, Blocking the False Expectation Tank. Uh, I know a lot of people personally do this and, you know, wish it wouldn't happen, but it hits you hard when it does. Uh, if anybody ever tells you that no network marketing is easy, they're lying. Okay, so it requires some skills, some time, and you have to put the effort in. On the other hand, if they tell you, you know, maybe getting some free product is easy or maybe make a, a little extra money a month, hundred, two, three hundred dollars a month, that's something that you can do, but it's still gonna take some time, it's gonna take some effort on your part to continuously get that. But you know, once you get it, you're pretty much set in if you just maintain and you can get that free product, an extra three, four hundred dollars a month, whatever you choose to get, and chance are it, it may build. Alright. So Whatever happens, uh, you know, somebody tells you you're going to make millions of dollars doing something and it's going to be easy, I can always guarantee you it's a lie. Okay, there, there should be no job or task out there or a uh, system you can do that's going to guarantee you that you're going to make a million dollars in a year and all you have to do is, you know, a couple hours of work a week. It's not going to happen. Okay, if you want big money, you have to put in big time, big effort. So one of the things here is, um, you know, you need to set realistic goals and picture yourself. Uh, one thing that I suggest and the book suggests as well is set short, medium, and long-term goals. Okay, so set maybe your first month goal in the business, the six month goal in the business, a year in business, two, three, four, five, and 10 year goals. Okay, so it doesn't hurt to set these goals because if you blow past them, you blow past them. If not, at least you shot for a high goal. Um, all right, so if, if somebody tries to misguide you here and uh, tells you that you know you can make a lot a lot of money working part time in three months, some people can do it. Some, some. It's very few. But a realistic goal, if I was going to tell you, if you're going to do this full time, do what it takes. Listen to your sponsors, your leaders, uh, the programs, do personal development. If you put a year of time in straight being consistent, then you should have a really good income, and hopefully you should break that six-figure mark. That's being very consistent, doing what it takes, and not, you know, kind of just breaking out your shell. Now, if you're doing a part-time, if you want to reach these, it's going to still take you, you can do it, but it's going to take you two, three, four, five plus years to reach that, unless you, you really get lucky, which doesn't happen often, and you uh, do exactly what it takes. So... I just want to make sure you get that clear. Uh, you know, I don't want anybody to jump into business with me, especially in thinking they're going to be filthy rich in a month or two months or six months or a year. It's probably not going to happen. So I'll just tell you uh, to make realistic goals. Uh, never rely on your upline to do all the work for you. If somebody tells you, hey, you just give me a list and I'll do it all for you and you'll be rolling the money, don't listen. It's just not going to happen because you're going to have to do a lot yourself. The people that you prospect that you think will be great, may not even trust me and not take my word on it. So you may only get one or two out of that business or that list. All right, so it's always better if you do the work yourself and it'll make you better if you do it as well. It'll pay off big later on. All right, it says, uh, you know, after, you know, a certain amount of time, some say three, five, or 10 years, which is still not bad compared to corporate America jobs where you're working 40, 50, 60 years just for retirement. But, um, they say we can retire network marketers, uh, you know, within that period of time, three, five, ten years, depending on your results. Now, our definition of retire is different than what you, um, you know, normally conceive as retirement. Uh, what normal jobs say is retirement is like completely leaving a job and getting paid for that job uh, based on what you made, you know, your, your last year, your, your top five income for whatever it may be. Retirement for us is basically a time that we can slack off a little bit, we can rest, we can enjoy life a little more, and still get those big income checks residually over and over. You never want to fully retire from the marketing business, and if you think about it, why would you? Uh, if you can take a marketing business, do two, three, four uh, calls a day or 10 calls a week, whatever it may be, it's still uh, you know, a potential to build your business uh, drastically over time. So, um, let's see. So, one thing here says uh, Iranian Jews that uh, no product or service needs to be sold. That That is, uh, 
uh, you know that's not true. <laughs> just straight up, that, that's not true. You have to be able to sell a product. You can't just sell a concept to everybody. And if your uh, system is based solely on members or affiliates, then uh, it's not going to be a stable company. You need to be able to sell whatever product it is that's in your business and get those customers that are going to like to uh, buy your product time after time after time to where you can get paid off either product flow like I do or commissions like most other companies do. Um, but, you know, uh, once again, you know, just keep this in mind. Uh, don't let the hype, you know, get to you. Um, a realistic goal that you can make is, uh, you know, making $100,000 after three years of pretty well straight effort. $100,000 a year, staying at home, working at home, you're in hours, talking to friends with great products. And you, you know, weigh your options. Would you like to work three years, make 100000 plus for the rest of your life? Or would you like to, you know, bust your butt every day in a job and maybe someday make that $100,000? The option's up to you, but uh, we can pro uh, provide a service for you if you like it. If you like, uh, you know, the content on this movie, once again, just email me at tkdblack2012 at yahoo.com. Like, share, comment on the post. I look forward to hearing from everybody, and thank you.